Have you been wondering how to use your phone, tablet, or laptop as a second monitor for your main computer? Well, today you're in luck. We're gonna be showing you how to use a free piece of software called Desk Screen that turns your devices into a second monitor. So you can use your phone, tablet, laptop, or even a smart TV and use it as a second monitor with your main computer. But hey, if you're new here, my name is Ken and this is Northern Viking Every Day and we bring you videos on reviews and how to's. So please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Let's go ahead and dive right over to my computer and show you exactly how to use Desk Screen. All right, so here we are on my computer. If you don't have Desk Screen already, again, it is free. You can find it at deskscreen.com. I will put a link below in the description. It's available for Windows, Mac, and Linux. And there's a ton of features that this software can do. You can create a second screen. You can share a screen and share apps, etc. And I'll let you read all about that. Now, one thing I should mention is the device you are sharing to. So if you're gonna share your computer to your phone, it does need to be on the same Wi-Fi connection. Um, so just make sure you are on the same Wi-Fi connection. And the other thing I should mention is that you do need to have a dongle um, to create a kind of virtual display. So um, for my desktop computer, I have this one here. Let me switch over on Amazon. This one is a virtual display port adapter, so you can buy one of those. So this needs to go into the computer that you're sharing from. So not on your phone, of course, but on the computer you're sharing from. So this is a display port adapter. If you have a laptop, you more than likely have an HDMI out port and you'd need one of these ones and that would just plug in on the side. And maybe you have a mini DP port, you can pick those up as well. And I will put links to all these below in the description so you can um, find them easily. Now let's go ahead and jump over to my desktop. I've already got Desk Screen installed. So the first thing I'm gonna do is plug this into the display port in the back of my computer. If you have an HDMI version, plug in your HDMI one. I'm gonna do that right now and I'll get right back to you. All right, so I've got my display port adapter all plugged in there. Let's go ahead and load up Desk Screen. And once you've got it loaded up, it's gonna look something like this. You can see um, there's a few different options here, connect, select, and confirm. Now you can donate here as well if you are enjoying this software, make sure you donate to Desk Screen. They did, did a really good job here for free. Um, so connect, select, and confirm. So right now we're in the connection stage and you can see that there's a couple different ways to connect. So you can scan a QR code here or you can copy this link and you just need to go to this link on your other device. So whether it's your phone, your tablet, or your laptop computer. Um, so if you wanna use the link, just go ahead and click on that. I'm gonna use the QR code today. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, just click on that. It'll make it bigger and I'm gonna turn on my camera here and I'm just gonna scan that and go to that website. And it's gonna take me right to the website here. You can see what happened on the screen here. It's asking me, um, telling me that I'm trying to connect to it. I need to click allow on my computer. And we're just gonna do that. And now we've moved over to the select stage where we can select whether we wanna connect just a specific application. And that's not what I wanna to do today, but if you just want a specific application, you can do that or an entire screen. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on entire screen because what I'm trying to do today is make a second screen here for my computer with my phone. So we'll click on entire screen. And now it's gonna ask me which screen I would like to select. So I can actually mirror my first screen here, the one we're recording on. So if I want two of the same screen, I can easily do that. Or I can select screen two over here and that's gonna create a second screen. So let's go ahead and click on screen two. And we're just gonna hit confirm here on the screen. And all of a sudden on my phone, I hope you can see that coming up, it's created a second virtual screen. I'm actually gonna turn it sideways here and I can click on the expand button. And you can see now that I have a second screen on my um, computer. So if I take my mouse and actually go over to the right, you can see my mouse cursor is over here on the right. I can go back to the left. And if I wanted to take a program, maybe I wanted to put Chrome over there, I can easily do that. I can, um, let's open that up. Oh, I went back to the wrong screen, but I can move that over here. And I can do all my work over there, my mouse, everything works very easily. And it's really that simple. Now, one thing I do wanna mention, right now you can see that it was set up as a second screen off to the right. If I wanna change that location on my main screen here, let me go here, I would just right click, I go down to display settings 
and I can look at my displays. You can see there's display one and display two. If I want to hit identify, you can see that it shows up on screen one and screen two, so you know which one it is. If I wanted screen two, my phone screen to be on the other side, I could just move that over here and hit apply. If I want it on top, so my mouse, so my cursor would go up rather than to the side, I can put it there and hit apply. I'm gonna leave mine to the right um, and just hit apply. But it's really that simple to use your phone or your um, tablet or laptop as a second monitor with your main computer using a free piece of software called Desk Screen. If you have used Desk Screen, I'd love to hear about it. Put it in the comments section below, whether you found it useful. And one final thing I should mention is that there is a minimal delay in the second screen just because you're running it over a Wi-Fi connection, which is to be expected. It's not connected like a typical monitor with a cable. I hope this video did help you out in connecting your phone, tablet, or laptop to your computer as a second monitor using Desk Screen. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media. You'll find all those links below in the description. Thank you so much for watching today and until next time, take care.